November marks American Diabetes Month. With increased awareness and focus on diabetes education, here to tell us about a new option to treat the disease is registered dietitian and certified diabetes educator, Elisa Violino. Thank you so much for being with us this morning. Thank you so much for having me. Hello. So, Elisa, what is this new option that we are educating people on today? Yes, it's called a Frezza. It's the only inhaled insulin that's administered at the beginning of the meal. It's a rapid acting insulin, which helps to control blood sugar spikes after the meal. And so how is this different? Uh, we're talking about this being a new option. How really does it work different? It's inhalation powder. So it comes in single dose cartridges of either four units, eight units, or 12 units. And you load the cartridges into a specially designed inhaler that you breathe in by your mouth at the beginning of the meal. So that will help control your blood sugars after the meal. And so if someone right now um, is dealing with diabetes and they're, and they're watching this, how can they figure out if this is right for them or if they want to get some more information? Right, it's for adults with type 1 and type 2 diabetes, so it's important for the audience to know it's not for everyone. It's not for people with chronic lung disease like asthma or COPD or if you smoke or recently stopped smoking or for children under the age of 18 years old. But the first probably process I would take would be to talk to your healthcare professional to see if this is right for you. And have you already maybe had a chance to talk to somebody that's already used this to see how maybe it's changed, you know, the way they uh, deal with their daily lives and, of course, deal with the, their diabetes? So I see people every day either one-on-one -on -one or in groups, and I see have all different treatment options that the patients or people with diabetes are on. They're either on an injectable insulin or, yes, the Afreza or oral medications. There's all different treatment options. But the most important thing for people with diabetes to know are their blood sugar numbers to see what is right for you because everyone's different, everyone's individualized, and what may be good for one person might not be good for another. Well, I'm glad that we're at least educating and get, getting some information out. So maybe this is a possible match for somebody that is out there. And I know, like we said, that uh, November is Diabetes Awareness Month. So is there anything maybe that you want information to get out to people that are, are dealing with diabetes or someone that maybe has somebody in their family that is? Yes, yeah, so I know everyone knows someone with diabetes, and if you're interested in a mealtime and hailable insulin, you can check out afreza.com. And on there, the website, you can navigate it and look at different things that you could bring, questions that you may want to talk to your healthcare professional about. And always remember during the holiday season to manage your blood sugars and be aware with what makes the blood sugars go high or low or where they should be with healthy eating, physical activity, and make sure you take your medications every day. Well, of course, like you said, over the holidays, we have to have uh, a little bit of extra awareness because there are so many things going on, pa parties at work, everywhere, and a lot of goodies that are out there, but we want to make sure we stay on track. So well, I want to thank you so much for being with us this morning, and we'll definitely check out that website. Can you give that to us one more time? Yes, it's called afreza.com. That's easy to remember. Thank you so much again. Thank you so much for having me. Stay where you are. We'll be right back.